Hi, welcome to um, CFS Fiberglass on this uh, frosty morning. Um, my name is Paul Lowe and I work in the admin section and I just want to show you a little trick that I've used for years um, with a product that we sell, that's um, isopropyl alcohol. What I do basically is um, make up my own um, de-icing uh, fluid. It's quite simple, I use um, um, one part water and uh, two parts isopropanol but um, what I do is grab an old um, kitchen cleaning bottle when it's empty and clean it out and then just fill it with my own solution so if I um, turn the cap just and then this isn't actually a scraper this is just an ordinary window in the cleaning see perfect what I'll do is um, show you how to make up the solution. It's very easy. According to how many vehicles you have, um, if you buy a, you know, five litres or even a litre, it'll last you quite a long time. But of course, if you've got a fleet of vehicles, this is really quite cool. So there we go. Very, very, very high quality um, de-icer made by yourself and also not costing too much money. Now, as promised, I'll show you how to mix up your own de-icer. Um, I forgot to mention that um, besides obviously de-icing your um, windscreen, you can use it for um, de-icing um, your locks, whether it's like a padlock or car lock or household lock in the um, extreme temperatures. Um, isopropanol we sell a lot of for all sorts of applications. It's mainly um, to do with um, cleaning sensitive um, electronic or audio, video, tape recorders, lenses of lasers, that sort of thing. Um, it removes smudges and dirt and fingerprints from cell phones um, and laptops, that sort of thing. Um, it's also um, useful for removing um, residue um, glue from sticky labels. Uh, it's good for cleaning glass um, and we sell a lot of it to the printing industry um, and they obviously use it for um, some sort of um, a cleaning process. So anyway, to mix up um, de-icer, it's really very simple. Um, we have two parts isopropanol, which I've already poured into those two, and one part water, which I've already poured into that. So it's basically two-thirds isopropanol, one third water, two to one. So um, what I do is use an old um, kitchen cleaning bottle. I've still got some in, um, some of my mixture already in from the, the video. Um, and what we're going to do is just quickly top it up. So just one part water, two parts isopropanol. And then hopefully, if I can get it into the bottle without spilling it too much, uh, we'll have topped up the Ooh, that's lucky. That's just the right amount. Cool. Right, so that's that. Put it back and I'm ready to go. Now, um, you could buy one litre, um, but the thing is, by the time you've purchased um, the amount from us and paid, paid the um, delivery, it's really well worth getting five litres, because this, this would last me um, probably three, maybe four years. Um, so I, it's just a matter of um, you know, uh, quantity over um, the cost of um, delivery. But great stuff. Very high quality and um, should cost a lot less um, for the quality.